Welcome to Wolf GMC Buick. Today we're going to be taking a look at a pre-owned 2022 Toyota Tundra 1794 edition. Smoked mesquite paint with a saddle tan interior. Under the hood you have a 3.4 liter V6 engine paired with a 10 speed automatic transmission. Some features you can expect to find includes heated and cooling seats with a heated steering wheel, adaptive cruise control, power dual pane sunroof, wireless charging, and so much more. Let's go take a look. First, we'll go ahead and take a look at the interior. You have that saddle tan color scheme on the door panel as well as along the dash at the front of the vehicle, the center console and the seats, storage on the bottom and center of the door panel with power windows, mirrors, and locks as well as memory settings. On the panel next to the steering wheel, you have a few controls including some interior and exterior lighting controls, your rear parking sensors, heated steering wheel along the bottom there as well, power controls for the steering column on the side of the steering wheel, you have the brown leather bucket seats with power controls and lumbar support on the side. Inside the vehicle, on the left-hand side of the steering wheel, you have some steering wheel audio controls, voice recognition, as well as directional controls for the display in front of you. The right-hand side has your gap adjust for your adaptive cruise control, lane keep assist, and a few other controls um, for your entertainment display. The entertainment display itself has navigation. You can see the map on the main display there. It covers the whole screen, nice and big. The audio will have your AM, FM, Sirius XM radio. You can connect your phone uh, to enable Bluetooth. Uh, your phone settings if you're connected, as well as several other vehicle information and settings for the display itself. Below the screen, you will find the climate control. This has your temperature gauge, fan speed, air conditioning controls, as well as the heated and cooling seats for the driver and the passenger with an outlet on the right and your volume dial on the left. Just below that, you'll find a few more controls. This includes some trailering settings, your hazards, traction control, you can turn those on and off. Electronic parking brake, as well as your automatic brake hold. You can turn those on and off there. Storage compartment at the front, which is also your wireless charging pad, just in front of the dual cup holder. And just below the shifter, you have several different driving modes uh, and their selector, as well as your tow and haul mode there. The center console here, you have the small compartment on the top here, you can open that up. You can slide the center back, giving you access to the center console on the inside and a couple of outlets for you to use. You can also open the entire thing, making it much easier to get access into that center console. Up top, you have the rear view mirror with a full camera display. Further up, you have the power controls for your sunroof and some interior lighting controls. And just in front of the passenger, you have the glove box, so there's some storage space in the front if you need it. Moving on, we'll go ahead and take a look at the exterior. You have that smoked mesquite paint, the Toyota emblem in the center of the grill, chrome accents around that grill there as well. LED headlamps, aluminum wheels with the Toyota center caps, black, black trailering mirrors with your integrated turn signal and blind spot indicator at the front, chrome door handles, and you have the black assist steps on the side there. At the back, you have the Tundra, etched into the tailgate on the back directly in the center the chrome handle on the tailgate here as well you can open that up plenty of storage space in the back you have cargo tie down locations at each corner as well as onboard power and a couple of lamps so you can see in the dark and the easy lift tailgate makes it super easy to close when you're all done finally we'll go ahead and take a look at the interior in the rear you have that same color scheme you had in the front magazine holders on the backs of the seats the brown leather seating here as well. The center will fold down for cup holders for the rear passengers. You can lift the seats, giving you access to the under seat bucket storage. You can pull the handle on the side here to put the seat back into place. On the back of the center console, you have two cup holders, your rear heated and cooled seats, as well as a few outlets for the rear passengers to use. Thanks so much for joining me as we took a look at a pre-owned 2022 Toyota Tundra 1794 edition. If you liked the video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel so you can get more video reviews just like this one, and we hope to see you in the near future.